Sorry, little lady. You can do it yourself. Um... No. Oh, Hi, it's Shay Lisi. Welcome back to my channel. We are headed up to Orlando to hang out with Blockhead on his birthday. I'm taking Willem Dafoe's The Green Goblin there. My choke just doesn't stay out. Oh. Mine doesn't either. It's common for the problem. Can't go to Orlando without stopping at the stab and grab. Wow, I actually have gas. You did not. You could fit $11 on that bike? You must have been bone dry, dude. Bigger on the inside. These gas prices are outrageous. $4, almost cheaper to buy weed. Wise, <laughs> you never know. I don't know what kind of gas miles this thing is gonna get, so I wanna. Oh, cause it's your first time riding on the big board kit for a long time. Any, yeah, anything more than a few miles. Either way, 100 miles will both be probably turning on a reserve by the time we get there. It's pouring out here. It'll also be the first test to see if this stuff actually stays fine in here or if the exhaust makes it boil over. Oh no! Well, I mean, hopefully it doesn't. That's why I put this exhaust kit on there. Why wouldn't you put it on the other side? Why wouldn't you put it. The bag is half it up. Well, why wouldn't you just. Do the old switcheroo. No, the bag's on this side. <laughs> Ram and speed, baby! Here we go! Oh, look! That's David! I've never met up with a friend this way, just waiting for us on the side of the road. That's so cool! Oh, yay, friends! Oh, we're passing the mouse! Honestly, this track went by really fast. I think it's maybe because I haven't ridden so long. I'm just like, woo! Everybody was so great! Uh oh, Josh is out of gas! We made it a lot farther than I thought we would, anyways. Oh, I hit my reserve 87 miles. It's pretty good. Not that much worse. I think I got like 90 something before. My phone also died, so I need to go into my phone. <laughs> Only 10 minutes until I'm in the warm embrace of Blockhead. Oh my god, did you drop your bike? It, Shay. You I dropped, dropped it? it you down. dropped it? Yeah. Oh my god. Girls dropping bikes. Dumb girl. Dumb girl drops her bike. Stop riding. That's why I title every single video on my YouTube. Wow, you let her ride, Goldzilla? Yeah, hey, you can ride it too. Can ride this? What is it? Yeah, on Okay. Be good to him. This has a quick shifter and an auto blipper. So if you're going fast, you don't even have to pull and clutch. You just press up and it'll shift up for you. Okay. If you're going like higher RPMs. If you're just like lower RPMs, use the clutch. Ah, uh, dude, your shoes. Okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this bike's so fancy! I'm riding Blockhead's MT-09, and this is the smoothest ride I've had in a while! Oh my god, that's stupid! That's so fun! How is that so fast? like to race my own bike. It feels bad, man. I don't know anything about this bike, but it looked really cool and Blockhead was riding it, so I wanted to try. Oh my God, it's so fun. It's so fun. Me too. 
Patch made in heaven. I like all of these accessories he's put on. It's made the bike so unique. I can't say I really enjoy the shape of it. It's like a that triangle but it's so smooth it's so lightweight shifting gears is no problem especially after riding my sportster this is just a completely different bike than my sportster comparing willem defoe's the green goblin to this mt09 it's apples and oranges okay like they, there's no similarities I'm a talented, independent, self-sustaining, strong. I know where the kickstand is. Boys find me attractive. No gas in it. Well, I gotta go find a gas. I guess I'm not test riding it then. You can go put gas in it if you want. <laughs> me? <laughs> me? Put gas in a motorcycle? You're a pretty little lady. You can do it yourself. Um, no. Like this. It was so fun. I shouldn't be allowed to have a motorcycle like this. Why? You rode the Sportster S. It's faster than this. Yeah, but I feel like I hardly rode the Sportster S because my arm was broken half the time I had it. I love him. I also love him. <laughs> I guess him too. <laughs> sitting there watching some ancient alien <laughs> shit on TV dude. He's like, if you run out of gas, I'm gonna laugh at you because it actually would be Blockhead's fault this time. <laughs> it's actually Chris's fault. He ran it on the dyno, so. Wow. You blaming sin? somebody else? Yep. Time to bid adieu to Blockhead and her two wheels. And Iron J Moto too. <laughs> we can't kiss with helmets on. I love you. Bye. It's good seeing you. Yeah, good seeing you too. Oh my god. Blockhead didn't leave my bike in neutral? Is he trying to kill me? Think about a gas. Why? He put my shit on off! Blockhead! He turned my gas off! <laughs> Curse you, Blockhead! Nice little back road before we sit on the highway for two hours. Time to go ram and speed back home, try and make it in time for my live stream on Twitch. Josh and I started a new podcast called Daddy Issues, where we talk about, well, the obvious. We'll be uploading the highlights to the Brap Star YouTube channel. So come check us out on Twitch or on the Brap Star YouTube channel. We just went up to Orlando to spend a little bit of time with Josh and John to plan for Mama Tribe. That's it, we're doing it. We bought the tickets, they came in today, and we're going to Mama Tribe. Oh my God, how are we just getting to Disney World? I feel like we've been driving in Orlando for a hundred miles. I get a drove to Orlando in the time it takes to get through Orlando. Oh my God, we're just now getting to I-4. How is this possible? I hate Orlando. I love Blockhead though. Which feeling do I feel more though? My hate for Orlando or my love for Blockhead? I'm just casually listening to my book and I'm like, why are we all pulling over? Josh has a f***ing flat tire. Thankfully, one of the boys was still at Forgotten Angels, so we were able to have one of the boys bring us a trailer and save Josh's Sportster. In the meantime, Josh is riding home on the concourse, and we'll just have to deal with whatever's wrong with the Sportster tomorrow. You guys are wondering why we're always late to our live streams? This is why. Dumb shit always happens to us all the time. Ooh, I'm almost at 1,000 miles! Like, since I reset it. Oh! 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 Oh!
Come on, come on, come on. Oh! <laughs> Thank you so much for tuning in to this week's episode. Her Two Wheels and Blockhead are officially coming to the Forgotten Angels camp out in March. And if you have any questions about it, go head over to the Facebook group and I can answer any questions for you there. If you pre-ordered anything from the Brack Star website, we will have that delivered to you very soon. Our pre-orders are coming in probably tomorrow. So we'll have some available for the Valentine's Market at the Dirty Shame this Sunday, the 12th. I'm also gonna be selling some of my resin stuff. I've got tons of stuff getting ready right now. I've got a bunch of gas caps. I'll cover the lewd ones. And then I've got lots of other stuff getting ready too. Josh and I did post a day late today. Today is Thursday. So come hang out with me and Josh on Twitch tonight, 7 to 9 p.m. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the ding dong diddle, do all the things. I'll see you tonight on Twitch and then I'll see you back here on Sunday. Bye. <laughs>